Hey Adam, just like the last two videos, delete your account. Wow, Hillary Clinton. <laughs> that's not re that's not irrelevant anymore. <laughs> it's All I'll right. go back to Psychonauts. We had some problems getting this episode. We had some started. problems starting this one. And I'm gonna rub I it said in. three, two, one, oh wait. <laughs> I'm not deleting my account. I know you're not. <laughs> it's a jokey joke. Gotta make sure you didn't mess it up somehow again. <laughs> Defeat the big monster yeah. I saw. Let's set meat on fire. Nice. <laughs> Nice voice acting, Rich. Rich? Even Richard Horvitz. Oh, right. Any guy? Apparently you can't set the rabbit on fire. I needed to try that. I'm going to try and set a lot of stuff on fire in this playthrough now that I have that. Jeez, you pyromaniac. What? Stop burning everything. Actually, in this game they call them fire starters. And... Why? Well, that's not that done with. <laughs> it wasn't a boss or anything. It was just... I don't know. <laughs> Continue pursuit of dream bunny. Can you light the vines on fire? Oh wait. Everybody has emotional baggage. All of them. That's deep. <laughs> Look, it's meat. Yeah. Can you cook the meat? I don't think so. Uh, some you can. Oh, and there's another thing. If only I bought that mental cobweb duster. Don't tell me I am. <laughs> Aaron, we're going to have to grind for more money later. Oh, I know, and I fear it. <laughs> what? I fear Aaron, it. Aaron, it could be worse. I could have unedited it. That is true. <laughs> Actually, this is one of the more heavily edited playthroughs I've ever done. <laughs> it's... Well, yeah. I think I lost the rabbit. Good going. You lost the one thing leading you to the thing. Oh, yeah, I go right going. back to the beginning. <laughs> I Here got turned around. Go. Oops! <laughs> that... All tarantula eggs! <laughs> it's... Oh no. <laughs> I showed you guys that picture, right? You showed me. Oops! All tarantula eggs! Now how'd that happen? You gotta eat them really fast. Better eat them before they hatch. <laughs> I'm gonna have to edit that in now. <laughs> oh dear. I'm sorry, dear Oops. viewers. Oops. Oh. The buckles look like eyes. You How sweet. I command you to stop. Dang. Is that ever <laughs> it's... Oh, it's the sensors. Yep, the sensors are in your mind as well. Well, I guess they're in all of us. And did I tell you that time I drew a sensor? I don't know. You could have, and I just didn't know what the heck it was. I, it's... I drew a sensor. Apparently, there's like five Psychonauts groups on DeviantArts because I added that picture. I, I I took a picture of it and added to DeviantArt, like I do with all my drawings, and like immediately it got added to like five different watch lists. <laughs> Apparently, there's a big Psychonauts uh, fandom on DeviantArt. This does seem like a game. This does seem like a DeviantArt game at times. Yeah, but like the the happy happy DA, and not the one the dark <laughs> side of DA. The dark side of DA. Well, <laughs> why meat? Teeny tiny sensors. What? Why meat? We'll, uh, we'll, we'll discover that later. Is it like the the classic Pokemon fan game, Meat and Meat Two? Oh, oh, uh, you, you mean uh, you mean Woodbridge or <laughs> whatever it was? Wet moat. Wet moat. <laughs> Surprisingly, they both have kind of similar content, like content matter. But and I was thinking of doing that as a April Fool's Day thing with you. Didn't Shofu do it? Yeah, but I knew Shofu do it, so you probably would have seen it. So. Yeah. Yeah, you don't think I know my memes? Do you know your Pokemon memes? I know a few of them. Do you know your competitive Pokemon memes? Yeah, probably. Do you know not. about stuff such as, um, such as, uh, Rotom, um, Fan with, um, with an air balloon? Nope. No? Nope, we no. The meme is that gravity nullifies all of the- oh. Like I said, this is one of the shortest worlds, so they're just kind of together. <laughs> it's... They're, they're friends, yeah. like everyone should have. Like all the emotional baggage. Gotta go high. There's a bunch of stuff you can do up here. Um, I can't do all of it yet, though, because I don't have the proper abilities. I don't know what hit me or where it came from, so I'm just kind of attacking Look, random. it's emotional baggage. Oh.
This video is going to be full of awkward pauses. <laughs> I'm sorry. Take a shot every no, time no. I have an awkward pause. <laughs> that's that's 50 shots. All right. So there are 10 levels in the game and um, and five emotional baggages in each. I right, also take a shot every time Adam doesn't know something. Oh, we don't want our viewers to die. <laughs> you don't know that. I don't want my viewers to die. All right. Did you, there he is. There we go. There are the tinies. Now those are the normal sized ones. The this tinies. like ground pound is probably the easiest way to take care of a bunch of these oh, if they're the swarming bomb. you. Yeah, and the bombs just kill them all. <laughs> it's the bombs hurt friends and foes, which is convenient. Maybe they're friends to no one. They're not. Ever friends. think about that? Oh, there's the hat box tag. Oh, adventure fourth until the unknown, <laughs> dear viewers. Bell. That was a good idea. <laughs> it's. You know it's a good idea? Blowing up all of the things. Yeah, it's... Is that a bathtub? What's with all the fish? Raz can't swim! He literally can't swim! It's, it's, see, it's symbolic of his... His hopes and dreams. His hopes and dreams. Of being a fish boy. Yeah. You think rain hurts him? I don't know. You think this creepy guy hurts him? Saying that the river doesn't hurt him. like to refer to as the brain. You see, son, it's just no good. I hate to be so blunt. Why is he here? This guy. Meet, um, one of the villains of the game. People are always saying that. What do you think's wrong with my brain? Dogen's here for some reason. Why is Dogen here? <laughs> this is your Tumblr. You can upload whatever you want to your Tumblr, and no one else can put their opinions on the page. He's gonna take his brain out. The interior is decorated like a brain. I noticed. Shh. He has a creepy arm. And he had a robot arm. Worry, Dogen. I'm coming up there why is why was the first thing I thought? Huh, Dogen here. Why Dogen? <laughs> well, wouldn't you save your best friend in your dream? <laughs> it's... Get inside the nightmarish tank. Oh, hey! Oh, no, that's 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 not part of the video. <laughs> it's... Oh. oh, well, anyway, someone's playing Night in the Woods? No, into... Yeah. I think that's Ryan. Hi, Ryan. Wait, Ryan hated Undertale. Why is he playing Night in the Woods? Different game? <laughs> no. Aaron, I've never met a Night in the Woods player who didn't also like Undertale. But have you ever met a Undertale player who didn't like Night in the Woods? I don't know. I don't know. Come on, Raz, your friend. Pick up the pace, boy. The, this part of the game is not really portrayed that well. The chamber Dogen was in is at the top of this tree. Oh, wait, okay. Wait, oh, I just got a new power. <laughs> it's... Why is Sasha... Oh, yeah. I just realized Sasha is kind of watching you do this. Yeah, so, like, 50 things happen there at once. In order to get past that point, we need levitation, which we don't have yet, so he's taking us out. He's telling us that Videlo, the other camp counselor here, is a master at levitation, so we should go talk to her. You'll need this oarsman's badge. Oh, that can levitate. Why not learn from the badge? <laughs> you can't learn from the badge. You can learn from anything. So a lot just happened at once. Yeah. Yeah, that, that's like one of my big problems with this game. A lot can happen in a matter of seconds, and it's very overwhelming. Although, uh, one thing we did do was, uh, we are now ranked 20, so we do have, or we can get another ability from Crawler, so let's go ahead and do that. What is it gonna be? Telekinesis. Telekinesis. There is no spoon. <laughs> the one thing you know psychics for. <laughs> it's... Up oh, here we're gonna, uh, close up on the badges. Oh, the question mark boy is confusion. Confusion? That's what, that, that's what telekinesis does. Raz, put down the camera. <laughs> put down the camera. Now, this one, um, I'd probably rank it around the middle in terms of usefulness. Um, it's used more for puzzles than for combats. So basically what you do is you hold it down in order to grab onto something, and then uh, you let go to throw it, and it's, that's basically it.
Oh, this is the line I was thinking of. Yeah, that's a reason to, to eat psychics. <laughs> it's about baggage. emotional baggage, if you will. Ooh. Hoops! Where's Barkley when you need him? Oh, be careful now. I just no stop. <laughs> I think you can pick him up. <laughs> every every NPC has a reaction to being picked up with telekinesis. This thing actually locks on pretty well, so you never really need to aim it too well. Okay, thanks. <laughs> Locking on is never really a problem. Yeah, as you, you kind of see it just kind of snaps in place. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Mad hoops. You throw the trash can at Crawler. I think so. Kablooey! Throwing something against a wall is a little more destructive than tossing it around on the ground, isn't it? Oh no, another one of my oh. senses. <laughs> I thought this was his mind. You know, I, you know, um, Blue Tinfoil Boy was here. <laughs> so I guess Raz's mind is like a one-way party. I don't, it's a one-way party. You mean you can go in, but you can never go out? You can never come out. You can never come out. Raz just has to think about it. There you go. Looks like the trash took him out. Put it in the trash. Put it in the trash. Mimi Big. Oh, me, oh no. <laughs> Alright, it's Monty Python. It's either Monty Python, um, uh, Film Cow, or Jack's films. Once we start saying their quotes, we can never stop. Oh, speaking of which, I was on Yai. You, you was on Yai. Uh, it was the um, it was the fake facts video, um, the one where he makes like fake news and you're meant to spread it. The second one. Yeah, the second one. The second one. That's important. Oh, we're back at this. Mimi, big disappointment. <laughs> the uh, the the fake fact I entered was a uh, fun fact. The word swag appears twice in the Bible, and he added it. I was featured on Yai. I was the last one too, so I think he liked it. Look oh, at that, boys. There's Videlo talking to us over intercom. He's famous. She. Our bro is famous. I'm talking to oh. vote you. Oh, me, me. I, you don't think I can't see that. <laughs> there was... Freaking Videlo. I like Videlo quite a lot, actually. This is like the one character I know about. I don't know what her level is. I just know a lot of people like it or think Wait, it's Wait, how do you know who Videlo is but don't know what her level is? She has like one of the most infamous levels of the game. Um, I think it was maybe two or three years ago. I like watched a top ten scary levels in video games. This like... is, it's not a scary level. It's just a ton of fun. And they talked about her level or something, and I remember her, but not her level. We will do her level next time. It's birded. On Game Grumps? Right next to you. To huh? To you, to you, to you. Hey. you see, he doesn't understand something. Take a shot. Have you guys I know what Game Grumps is. <clears throat> we were playing hide and seek and... Stop. <laughs> <laughs> Don't talk about stories. Said, I'll count to this kid's whole gimmick is that he just tells really long stories. You mean God. the lake? These guys are jerks. He goes way into the woods. Okay, we're... Bye. <laughs> it's... Alright, are you gonna do... Good. Oh. It's the rich one. <laughs> it's the lackey. It's the lackey. <laughs> it's like the rich girl in the high school show. You think it's a richy rich kind of thing where his best friend is literally a hobo? <laughs> it's... Oh, that's right, Richie Rich. Like, he had heck? three friends. He had, I think a, one of them was a girl, one of them was a fat kid, and one of them was a hobo kid. <laughs> it's, and his rival was another, like, slightly less rich kid. A slightly less rich kid. Uh, and is also his doggo. He, he had Dollar, or Bill, I don't know. I think his name was Dollar. I actually, my dad owns some. Oh, it's the yeah. Russian guy. The genetically... Oh, look at, look at how he hits the ball. Good. The genetic... Boop. <laughs> It was the genetically engineered Dalmatian, so it would have, like, dollar signs instead of spots. My dad still owns some of those comics. Yeah. We they were really, the really cool. Yeah. They were advertising, um, like, those, uh, those, like, um, what are they called? 
Wiki. Like Hostess, they make a bunch of like pastry stuff. Hostess, the one, or... the one that's kind of like filled with a, like a cherry filling or the something. Fruit pies. Yeah, the fruit pies. A lot of comics did that. They they said they advertise. Oh, no, that's a hat. <laughs> I love how some of them think it's a good thing. Also, watch the ball when I pick Maloof up. Oh, okay. Yeah, let's just hold it there. It's not gonna play his animation anyway. <laughs> you can't throw kids, you can only hold them up. Darn. You can't throw NPCs. What if I want to throw those NPCs? You can't. <laughs> what was I saying about Richie Rich? Um, the fruit pies. Yeah, yeah. They, um, they did, like, these sponsorships, um, although the sponsorships were a little more- Oh, I have enough money again. The sponsorships were a little interesting in the sense that, like, the point of a comic was actually the, the, um, the, like, uh, the, the pastries. Yeah, like, there's old superhero ones where it's like, oh, no, Ant-Man is suddenly a bad guy and he's hurting, and that's not a fun. No, 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 and he's, like, stealing the pastries, yeah, stealing and we gotta go- Like, that's what- that's what brand deals were like back in the day. But it'll be like the entire problem is solved by the fruit pies. <laughs> Freaking dang. So we got the cobweb duster. Also, there are like the old ads in those magazines, like, want to build a hoverboard? Want to build a hoverboard? Or a money printer for five dollars? Oh, ho, ho, old comics. Freaking heck. Well, it was like less than five dollars. Less that, than five dollars. Because that was before people uh, started begging for to raise the minimum wage every six months. Right? Okay, sure. <laughs> yes. I had the strangest machine induced dream about you. Eevee. Well, first of all, oh dear. <laughs> me down to Maybe don't tell the whole story. Oh, <laughs> <gasps> he's brainless. You can't have a brain blast. <laughs> dream was true. Dogen, don't worry. I know where your brains are. They're in like this crazy dream thorn bush straight jacket tower that I cannot see because of the <laughs> it's... You should probably um put him somewhere. He's so going he to the TV lounge, don't worry. He won't be learning uh, levitation though. And we should do three episodes this time because the levitation level is just that fun. Coolio. You want to? <laughs> Why not? Sure. I have nothing else to do today. You're, you're gonna really like this level. You gotta try it with everyone. When did you get the cop up dust? I bought it while we were talking about Richie Rich. The best. <laughs> I was personally a fan of the blandest toast ghost, Casper. Oh, jeez. He was very bland. Casper and Richie Rich are made by the same team. Some they people forget that. They look exactly alike. Right, not in the movies, though, which is what most people unfortunately know those properties for. <laughs> the Richie Rich movie. Oh, uh, that movie was bad. Oh, it, it... I used to love Casper Meets Wendy. Oh, I remember Wendy, yeah. Her, his witch friend. Yeah. The one Wendy taught the world that not all witches need to be evil. <laughs> it's... Before every other witch show taught kids that. Yeah, you know, I love the idea of a of like a good guy witch. There's a lot of those. I know. Well, there's a lot of them now. <laughs> it's... I can't get that right now. You can't actually jump out of the um, out of the canoe. You know, Aaron, how do you spell canoe? Canoe. Exactly. <laughs> it's, it's like it's it's a super hard word to learn on your first try or spell, spell balloons. on your first try. B a l l o o n. Okay. Don't worry. I got in contact with your father. Spell no, that's the last thing we want. We don't want to go back. Oh, gotta go. The race is starting. Lily. Oh, hey Raz. Listen, I made you something. It's kind of stupid, but they stole Dogen's brains. No, he's just like. <laughs> oh, she's the sassy one, Adam. That's your character. I love that line. <laughs> she's the sass. I'm not sure if you saw, but I think she made us a friendship bracelet. Ain't that sweet? And apparently, we're having the same nightmare. But how? And why all the meat? So the meat in the level is relevant. Okay. Aaron, it is more relevant than you can imagine. <laughs> No, we're not gonna find out why though until like the third to last episode. <laughs> what is true psychic tales? <laughs> Probably one of like their TV shows. Like, I don't know how I used to watch all those beautiful ghost shows. Oh, I'm not sure if you noticed that either, but um, when you when people pal the canoe, they just kind of hold their hand up and it goes. <laughs> <laughs> well, they're psychics. 
<laughs> I'm gonna burn all these kids because again, everyone has like a different <laughs> Every single NPC has, oh, has a different reaction to this and I just love that and I gotta show them all Actually, one of my favorite fire lines is coming up. It's when you cast fire on on Videlo Alright, here we go. Okay, I think we're almost done. <laughs> it's... I've been ordered. You know, I'd expect that sort of recklessness from Morso. Morso is Oleander, the coach guy. Oh. They, I think only she calls him by his first name. <laughs> it's... Really? I didn't know you noticed. Well, you know, I only work with the best team. Ooh. <laughs> okay, let's party. All right, let's party. Videla's level is a fan favorite. Super excited for this. Oh, wait, what do you think her level is? Um, I think it's... Doors. You think it's doors? Doors. The theme is doors. <laughs> We're gonna find out if she's right next time. On Game Theory.